Hello friends, my name is Tofiq and you're watching my channel Graphics Den. So in this video, I'm going to talk about symbols, how to create symbols and use them in Corel Draw. So let's get started. Now, symbols can be very useful if we use them properly. Uh, symbols can save us a lot of time and effort. So first of all, let's say uh, I want to use a same object multiple times in any, let's say I'm drawing a diagram and I'm going to use same object multiple times it can be anything it can be text or object so first of all to open the docker you need to go to window dockers and symbols the shortcut key is control plus f3 in windows now we need to create or convert any object to symbol first so i will color this and as i said earlier we can uh, use any object or text as symbol so Let's see if I want to convert this object to symbol, simply click on this plus mark. You can also drag the symbol, not an issue, but I'm going to press here, new symbol, and you can name it anything that you want. So let's say I'll, I'll say, I'll write shape. So you can name it anything that you want. Now, after creating this or converting rather in, into this object into a symbol, we can copy this. Simply I am going to right click and copy or you can control Z control V it or you can simply drag it from here. I will undo this. Now I will I won't change the shape or rather size. I will copy this like this. And again I will copy this control C control V. Now as you can see I have used same symbol multiple times and we can use the same symbol symbol on multiple pages let's say i have 50 pages and i have used these same symbols on each and every page so let's say uh, once i created the symbol and used it then i realized that i need to change something let's say shape slight shape change or color change if we don't use symbol then it will take us a lot of time and effort but once we convert a object convert any object to symbol we can do that same thing pretty easily so let's say i want to change the shape and color so we need we simply need to click on the any shape and simply go to edit and let's say i want to change so i will convert this and i will change the shape i will also change the color so and once i click on finish as you can see each and every symbol is converted automatically so if you only change one symbol it all the symbols will change automatically so that is the main reason why we use symbols in Corora. as i mentioned earlier it will save us a lot of time and effort and sometimes it is not possible to pick each and every symbol so let's say i have used the same symbol 100 times so sometimes we may miss the symbol and uh, we can make mistakes so Creating a symbol first and using it multiple times, multiple times is very useful. So I will delete this now and I will show you same thing with text. So let's say I want this text. So I will write my channel's name, graphics then. Now I will convert this into a symbol. So I will name it text. You can name it anything that you want. And I will copy this and remember you need to copy it after converting it to symbol and how to recognize that it is a symbol or not simply see over here keep an eye over here so if this shows then it is a symbol so I will again copy paste now let's say I want to change the spelling it can be anything it can be your address or your contact number so later you realize that we need to edit something so click on any of the text it doesn't really matter and go to edit and I, let's say i want to change to design again i want to change the color and also i want to change the font as well i will choose this font now once i click on finish everything will be changed like this so that this is why symbols are very useful in Corel Raw 
so many people don't know about this feature but this is a very important feature if you are working with like if you are doing complex work like diagrams so you can use this and it will be very useful so just remember first we need to convert it into a symbol and then we need to copy it so i hope you find this video useful if you do please give this video like and subscribe to my channel i will see you in the next video till then bye bye and cheers